Hi everyone, my name is Brittany and welcome to Townsville City Library's Digital Baby Time. Oh, baby rhyme time, sorry. Um, so today, I know things are a bit crazy out there, especially if you have a new bub or have a bub in your life. And we hope that these videos um, will create a sense of normalcy for you, even though we're delivering them in a bit of a different way. We still have our favorite rhymes and our favorite actions and songs uh, that we can sing all together in the comfort of your home. Okay, uh, as normal, we're going to start with our acknowledgement to country. All right. Here is the land, and here is the sky. Here are my friends, and here am I. We thank the Bindle and the Wulgarukaba people for the land on which we live and play. We promise to care for it every single day. Okay, thank you. Next is our hello song. So we want to say hello to all of our new parents as well that may be watching a Baby Rhyme Time video for the first time. Um, it's really important in those first five years of your child's life to talk, play, read and sing with them. And these can be done in everyday opportunities, singing to baby in the bathtub, reading when you're at the shops. Uh, any interaction is a great interaction when it comes to your children during this period. So uh, to start off, we're going to sing hi, hello and how are you? We're going to wave our hands. All right. Hi, hello and how are you? How are you? How are you? Hi, hello and how are you? How are you today? Yay, well done. Thank you. All right, let's get into it. This one's one of my favorite songs, a marsupial song. So it's to the tune of Farajaka. Uh, so we're going to uh, cuddle our koalas, our possums, our wallabies and wombats and our kangaroos too. So for all of our songs, if you want and if Bub is willing to, have Bub facing you. Um, they love to see your face when you're talking with them and this uh, helps them to learn what you're saying and what you're doing and then eventually repeat that over time as well. So we can give baby a cuddle, we can make ears behind our hair and then eventually we can bounce bub up and down as well. All right, let's go. Cuddly koalas, cuddly koalas, possums too, possums too, wallabies and wombats, wallabies and wombats, kangaroos, kangaroos. Well done. Okay. Okay. Next up, Gloomph went the little green frog. We love this one and we love this one in our toddler time too where all the little kids can go bouncing around. So if you do have children that are a little bit older than a baby and they're active, let them join in on this one. They can jump around like a frog, ask them how what a frog sounds like. If you're out, if you want to take them outside, show them what a frog looks like. That's a great interaction as well. Um, and baby can come along as well if you like. Okay, so let's go. This one, we're going to open and close our hands when our little frogs go good lumps. Uh, when we know that they go la di da di da, clap your hands together over baby. Wave those arms around. You can do that with baby's hands as well if they like to. If not, feel free to do it over the top so they can see it. Okay. Galump went the little green frog one day. Galump went the little green frog. Galump went the little green frog one day. And the frog went galump, galump, galump. But we all know frogs go la di da di da, la di da di da, la di da di da. We all know frogs go. La di da di da, they don't go galumph, glumph, glumph. Well done. I hope your babies loved that one. Our children and youth services librarian Joe loves that song, so she'll be glad to see other people love it as well. 
heads and shoulders is next. Now, we do this one sometimes in toddler time as well, so I always get myself mixed up with the rhythm of this song. This one's a bit more calmer, a bit more slower, which really suits babies. We need to talk and sing slow with our babies so they can hear us and eventually start repeating those words with us. If we talk too fast, they're not going to understand what we're saying and they're not going to take it in in the interaction as we're wanting them to. So nice and slow, um, always let baby see your face if you can as well. Okay, nice and slow with this one. Heads and shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, knees and toes. Heads and shoulders, knees and toes, we all clap hands together. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose, mouth and nose, mouth and nose. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose, we all clap hands together. Well done. <laughs> That one's really great too that you can change up to teach babies about their different body parts or if you're playing around tickling them, a great um, time for you to interact and include a rhyme which is always great for your children. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Okay, this is a really great one for bub facing you. Looking over, we're going to twinkle our little hands. We're going to lift them up higher and then we're going to make a diamond in the sky and then we're going to wiggle our hands back down over baby. Let's get ready. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are up above the world so high like a diamond in the sky twinkle twinkle little star how i wonder what you are yay Okay, two little fishes. So you can do this on your hands. We can have one little fish, two little fish, or you can do it on Bub's fingers as well. Keep that interaction up. I'm gonna do mine on my fingers today. So two little fishes swimming in a tank, one named Fred and one named Frank. Swim away, Fred, swim away, Frank. Come back, Fred. Come back, Frank. Yay. <laughs> okay, up and down. I'm a little unfamiliar with this one, so we'll give it a go. <laughs> Let's see. This one, we can lift our baby up high. If Bub doesn't want that, you can lift baby's hands or their feet as well. We're also gonna lower baby back to the floor, play with their hands, play with their feet. Alrighty, let's go. We're going up, we're going up as high as we can go. We're going down, we're going down, we're going down way low. Up, 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 up. Down, 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 down. Yay, well done. That one's really great if you like a baby that loves to be up in the air, moving around. I know some babies love that. Okay, we're gonna go rolling around. Rolling around on the sea. We're gonna roll, roll, roll. You can roll your own hands in front of baby. Let them see what you're doing. Or if bub likes, roll baby's hands as well. We're gonna bob around so then baby can bounce up and down on your lap if you like. Bounce them up in the air, whatever suits you. And then we're gonna go swimming. So you can show baby how to swim. Make their arms go through as well. Alrighty, let's go. Rolling all around in a boat on the sea. Roll, 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 roll along with me. I'm rolling all around in a boat on a sea. Rolly poly, rolly poly, roll. I'm bobbing up and down in a boat on the sea. Bob, 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 bob along with me. I'm bobbing up and down in a boat on the sea. Rolly poly, rolly poly, roll. 
I'm swimming all around in a deep blue sea. Swim, 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 swim along with me. I am swimming all around in the deep blue sea. Rolly poly, rolly poly, roll. Yay, well done everybody. Okay, I know sometimes with those songs it's really hard to go slow and I find there I went a little bit faster than I should have. If you do, that's completely fine. It's always nice though to have that conscious thought of I need to go slow so my baby can hear me. It may feel really weird for us. We're always used to going really fast all the time, um, but it really benefits our babies. So great thing to do at home. All right, we're going on another boat ride right now. We're gonna row, row, row our boat. So we're gonna row our boat gently down the stream so you can hold Bub's arms, sit them up on your lap if you like, and then row them back and forth, just like that. And then we can rock baby from side to side. If we see a crocodile, we could snap our hands. All righty, let's go. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Rock, rock, rock your boat gently down the stream. If you see a crocodile, don't forget to scream. Ah! <laughs> I know when we normally do sessions, babies really love that one. Hopefully they enjoy it just as much at home as well. Okay, rock it by your bear. This one is actually my all time favorite song to sing with babies and children. I absolutely love it. So I'm glad that it's in this one today. So this one, clap your hands in front of Bub. We're gonna hold out our hands and sing la di da di da. We're gonna lean forward or if you want, you can lean baby forward as well if they're sitting on your lap. So when we turn around, we can trace our finger over baby just like that. Or if they are up and moving around, twirl them around in a circle. We lift our hands in the air, rock our baby, and then pretend to go to sleep. All right, everyone, are you ready? Everybody clap. Everybody sing, la, 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 la. Bow to your partner, then you turn around. Hands in the air, rock -a by your bear. Bear's now asleep. Shh, shh, shh. Bear's now asleep. Shh, shh, shh. Thank you. Well done, everybody. What's your favorite rhyme to sing with Bub? Maybe you can pop it in the comments below. Okay, Old MacDonald had a farm. This one's really great if you do actually live out on a farm and you can take Bub out, show them all the different animals. If not, we'll settle for singing the rhyme. <laughs> okay, so with this one, we're just gonna make our hands uh, that these animals will make over Bub. We can make those noises yourself with Bub as well, if you like. Alrighty. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had some ducks, E-I-E-I-O, with a quack quack here and a quack quack there, here a quack, there a quack, everywhere a quack quack. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had some cows, E-I-E-I-O, with a moo moo here and a moo moo there, here a moo, there a moo, everywhere a moo moo. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Well done, thank you everyone. That's a really great one. You can actually extend that out as much as you like. So um, any animals that you want to include in it, go right ahead, baby will love it. Okay. Baba ba pink sheep. Let's see how we go here. So we're gonna nod our head with baby when we're saying yes sir, yes sir. We can touch baby's fingers and toes and then we'll touch their nose and nod our heads again. All right, let's go. Ba ba pink sheep, have you any spots? Yes sir, yes sir, lots and lots. 
spots on my fingers, spots on my toes, spots on the end of my little nose. Ba ba pink sheep, have you any spots? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Lots and lots. Well done. Okay, I think that we are coming up to the end of our session now. So as usual, our goodbye song is If You're Happy and You Know It. So this one, we're going to clap our hands. You can shake Bub's legs, bounce Bub around, and then we're going to wave goodbye to our friends. Okay, let's go. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then you really ought to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, shake your legs. If you're happy and you know it, shake your legs. If you're happy and you know it, then you really ought to show it. If you're happy and you know it, shake your legs. If you're happy and you know it, bounce around. If you're happy and you know it, bounce around. If you're happy and you know it, then you really ought to show it. If you're happy and you know it, bounce around. If you're happy and you know it, wave goodbye. If you're happy and you know it, wave goodbye. If you're happy and you know it, then you really ought to show it. If you're happy and you know it, wave goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching our baby rhyme time. We hope it's helped you today and we hope you've enjoyed it with your child or children. Just remember, sing to your child, read to your child anywhere, anytime. You can turn everyday activities into fun games, make cleaning, talking, anything with your child. They're going to love it, especially at the moment when everything is so crazy out there. This is a really great way for you to interact with your children and feel that sense of normalcy again. Thank you. We hope to see you next week. Bye.